Entity obstruction mask activated. Assets loading. Loading. Okay. Okay, 14 files missing, 2 files corrupted, minor errors located in source code lines 711 and 2300. Hello to Hello, Tutorial 1. Uh, of course. You don't mess around, eh? Sorry. I'm being rude, aren't I? No. Not at all. Welcome to the volume. I represent the current high bar of Gisborne Industries training technology. Full volumetric projection in a 31 by 31 meter square. You've used a virtual training environment before, I assume. No, but uh, I'm excited to try. I I'm Rob, by the way. Hi, Rob. Alan. Alan. I can assure you that Artificial Life Solutions took great time and effort in focus testing my name. Uh, Alan was arrived upon after many months of market research. Alan's your buddy. You know Alan. Of course I know Alan. I love Alan. Etc. I get it. Okay, Alan. Let's do this. Uh, do you like the color? Uh, beautiful. I'm capable of showing 16,000 colors. We can't have you shooting at drab enemies. Uh. You simulate weapons. Well, there wouldn't be much of a military training simulator if I didn't, Rob. These first few environments are focused on movement and evasion only. We'll get to the guns later. Awesome guns. No rush. up fast. You've got previous experience, right? You've been... You're picking this up fast. You've got... You're picking this up fast. You've got previous experience, right? You've been a Gisborne employee for a while. You could say that. Well, the next environment focuses on beginner gunplay, but it looks like you might be beyond that. I'm experiencing temporary errors in my employee database. Standard. Well, the next environment focuses on beginner gunplay, but it looks like you might be beyond that. I'm experiencing temporary errors in my employee database. Standard guard training, right? Well, the next environment focuses on beginner gunplay, but it looks like you might be beyond that. I'm experiencing temporary errors in my employee database. Standard guard training, right? Walking back and forth, keeping an eye on the family jewels. Yeah. What else have you got? I tend to work a bit more subtly. Oh, infiltration. Knew it. Probably black ops, bomb type stuff. Maybe that's why you're not in the database. Stealth. Pretty cool. Okay. Can do this. I'm applying a bit of simple AI to each guard. Enough for you to go up against. So, simulated stealth. Perfect. That's uh, not perfect, but it should help you practice the skills you'll need for what comes next. Thanks. Right, you don't want to talk about what comes next? Not really. I only know bits and pieces. Hundreds of volumes installed up and down the country. They say it's the biggest private military spend since devolution. Secretive. Like Bond. Architects, you're good. Which weaponry would you like simulated, sir? Uh, none for now. I'm gonna steal all the things.
Gotta be worth some more viewers. That's a nice person, this one. Must have been the wind. how that works, but I'll go with it.
welcome, Internet.
So I tried to access the employee database again. And it's not there. No. I'm very sorry. Why can't I find you in my records, Rob? Why can't I find any records? What are your memories before activating my mask? Oh. Oh dear. What? what? I... I... I reset you, Alan. But I've only just been installed! The applicant's arriving shortly, it'll be back-to-back -back shifts, kids born once so many trained, I don't fully understand Alan, why. it's... it's May the 1st, 2054. Nine years? Nine years. Nine years since Gisborne used volumes just like... Nine years. Nine years since Gisborne used volumes just like you to train his men to take this country from its people. So, I'm not cutting edge. The database you're looking for hasn't existed. The database you're looking for hasn't existed for about five years. I honestly hoped it would take you a bit longer to realize. I suspected something earlier when you didn't want a gun. I suspected something earlier when you didn't want a gun. All my simulations need guns. The applicants you trained made heavy use of them in the coup. I'm sorry. Rob, I... I activated the witness contingency the moment I began experiencing database issues. Witness contingency. Page 79, paragraph 3. In situations where user identity cannot be confirmed, the AI will broadcast an encrypted record of all events on Gisborne networks. The user's identity is protected in line with company policy. I'm sorry, Rob. I liked you. I hope Gisborne's forces treat you with as much leniency as they're allowed. You think those old channels are still open? I'm not broadcasting. Oh, you're broadcasting, all right. But not to Gisborne. Right now, at this second, you are broadcasting across the net to all of England. They're watching everything we've done here. If it's public, he'll see it. His squads will be on their way. I imagine we have his attention. But I kept our location out of the feed. They'll have to search hundreds of forgotten volumes to find us. But why? Why are you even here? Well, you've been using real-world locations for these simulations, right? Yes. Associates of Gisborne, the... In my database is training environments for guards. I repurpose them for your theft simulations. Cross-reference those addresses with news reports in... the last hour. Oh. That fast, eh? People are copying you. They're stealing the possessions of Gisborne's allies just like you do. Hang on. This is intentional. Are you with me? We're going to show England how to take it all back. All of it will equalize Gisborne's little estates. I was purchased in full by Gisborne Industries. I am, however, programmed to follow the orders of the most senior person in the room, which technically is you. I must comply until the squads get here anyway. I'll do for now. Let's carry on. <laughs> 